On Saturday, October the 19th, the ECS SWAT team traveled to Starkville, Mississippi to compete in the Mississippi Best Robotics Competition. According to the rules, the team had to create a robot capable of picking up objects and moving them into certain positions. The teams were required to write the computer code that would allow the robot to respond to a remote control as well as to construct the robot itself. Teams consisting of a spotter, the person responsible for moving the robot's platform into place, and the driver, the person using the remote to make the robot pick up and release the given object, were given 30 seconds to attach the robot to the platform, followed by a 3 minute round to accumulate as many points as possible. In stage 1, the robot needed to be able to pick up a wooden dowel and place it in a specific colored hole. For more points, the robot then needed to turn the dowel 180 degrees and tilt it on its side. Once the dowel was positioned, it needed to be slid into the upper hole of the apparatus. In the second stage, the robot needed to be able to pick up a hanger from ground level and rotate it sideways 90 degrees. From there, it is placed onto a certain peg, and when a certain number of colored hangers are placed on the certain peg, the team will accumulate that number of points. Based on the amount of dowels collected and the number of hangers placed, teams in the final round were tasked with picking up puzzle pieces from ground level and placing them two to four feet above onto a slanted puzzle piece. Each piece represented a part of a CPU, and if possible, when the team could complete the CPU, they would be awarded a number of bonus points. The ECS SWAT team, which stands for Students Working for the Advancement of Technology, under the direction of Coach Manuel Burton and Mr. Gene Rank, survived a field of 24 teams and advanced to the semifinals, then on to the finals, before finishing strongly in fourth place. The team consisted of Brian Underwood, David Reddick, Will Hewitt, Fisher Smith, Ian Romines, William Sanders, and William McGowan. We are very proud to see the SWAT team perform so well in their inaugural robotics competition.